Hi, I'm Dory and today I am painting a buck or a male deer and I am doing my absolute best to make this uh, look as realistic as absolutely possible uh, because this painting is part of a swap that I'm doing with my friend Chelsea. I'll have a link to her channel down below so you can take a look at her art um, because it's gonna blow your mind. You definitely need to check, take a look at her artwork. Her skill level is so many miles ahead of mine. Um, when she asked to do a swap with me, realism for realism, I was kind of like, whoa. Uh, because um, her pictures, when she tries to do realism, it is like photo realism. It is perfect realism uh, and I mean she gets right down to textures to reflections everything is absolutely stunningly perfect when she does photorealism and um, I just I kind of feel like my skill level is not quite there so <laughs> um, I did absolutely do my best on uh, drawing on a tiny level is a challenge for me to begin with and plus I am using watercolors <laughs> in this attempt at realism uh, you know you know I prefer dry materials photorealism is a lot easier for me to achieve if I'm using graphite or charcoal or you know something dry um, but I am fascinated by watercolors like I'm uh, low-key in love <laughs> with watercolors and it's um, actually extremely important to me. It's a huge, huge goal for me to be able to create photorealism with watercolors. I want to be able to do that. So uh, the only way to accomplish that uh, is to practice as much as I possibly can. So that's what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm actually really, really, really pleased with how this turned out. I would not call the end result photorealism, but it, it is realism, and it's just not super hyper realistic. <laughs> uh, I'm, I did uh, get some nice blur in the background. I got really nice light play on the antlers. Uh, I got really soft fur textures, kind of some wetness on the nose and eyes. And so yeah, I, I, I did achieve what I set out to do and I'm, I'm, I am very happy with how this turned out. And most importantly, uh, the person that received the art was happy. She was very, very pleased uh, with the art. So yay, <laughs> that, that was the goal. Um, how do you feel about this painting? Uh, tell me about what you think in the comments down below. And do you have any pointers about photorealism and watercolors? Uh, because it's honestly, it's just an incredibly different experience uh, with watercolors than it is with charcoal and graphite and things that I am used to. So any pointers are welcome. <laughs> I hope you have fun with this, uh, and if you are enjoying seeing these artworks, please subscribe so that you can see more artwork like this, and like the video for me so I know to do more stuff like this. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you next time. <laughs> Bye!